guys, thanks for joining me today on MDOR. Uh, for today's product review, I'm going to be bringing you guys the Filson Mackinac Cruiser. It's 100% uh, virgin wool coat. Uh, this is a very durable jacket. I'm going to give you guys an in-depth review here in uh, one second, so stay tuned. Alright, so here's the jacket itself. This company, Filson, is based out of Seattle, Washington. Everything they have is, is made in the United States, which is really nice. Um, in 2012, they really expanded when they, they sold to another company, and uh, they're, they're, they're creating a lot more items now, like luggage and outdoor gear. So, uh, But this, this coat itself is 100% virgin wool. Uh, the guy who founded this company originally was uh, designing things for the, the Klondike Gold Rush. So everything was outdoor minded. Everything was uh, intended for for durable uh, use. This coat is no exception to that. This thing is phenomenal. If you can see how thick this thing is, it, it is it is so nice. It is ridiculous. The pockets on here all have the the snap buttons on them, and they all have the Filson logo on each on each one. There is on the front. There is four front pockets. Um, the top left breast pocket up here also has three additional looks like pen pockets or knife pockets right here on the top those are pretty nice the inside of them there's also a, a pouch here a little pocket in here with a button on it as well there isn't one on this side but that's okay because there's so many pockets available on this there's also two hand warmer pockets on the front as well on each side as you can see um, the back of this jacket also has a pass-through pocket and I think it's intended use is for a map, but what I like to put in here is either a rain garment for, a, you know, like a poncho or some gloves and a hat, which is really nice because it seals up in the back and that way it's not so bulky in your front. This is, like I said, this is 100% virgin wool, so this is going to keep you warm regardless if it's wet or not. It can actually hold 70% of its weight in water before it even feels damp. So that, that, is, that is remarkable. I personally have worn this in freezing rain on hikes, five miles in, five miles back. I've worn it in snowstorms, rainstorms, and everything, and I, I have yet to have any moisture soak through to my undergarment. It, it's kept me warm the entire time. So this thing I've owned for a little over a year now, so it's tried and true, and this thing still looks the exact same as the day I got it in the mail. It's outstanding. I can't say enough about this Filson company. They really make a, a fantastic product. They stand by their products as well. Uh, these all have lifetime warranties on them for uh, manufacturer defects, things like that. If seams are going to pop out or for things that it's designed to use and it fails at, uh, they guarantee them and they will replace them at no cost or repair it if they can. So that is something I love in a, in a company and especially since it's American made. It's it's outstanding. I, I love this product. This style of jacket, the Mackinac Cruiser, um, it was originally designed. Well, the the style, not the company, but the style. It was it was for the British soldiers, and I think it was up in Michigan somewhere. They were they were designing these coats for the British soldiers because the tails of them of these jackets would go down too far and they would catch on the brush and in the snow and and collect it so they weren't they weren't meeting their <clears throat> what they needed them to do so what they ended up doing is they cut the tail of the jacket off and you got this style here <clears throat> it's a little shorter and and they call it the Mackinac Cruiser another little interesting fact about that is this style of jacket was so popular then when they were making these for even the, the private citizen that they ran out of material for this. And so what they ended up doing is they had the red and black pattern wool blankets. And so they said, well, you know what, let's just make them out of these. So they made them out of those. And it was a huge success and everyone loved it. And it continued from that day forward. And from that is where you actually get today the actual red and black pattern uh, shirts and jackets is actually from that era from those people that were making them up there because they actually ran out of wool or, or the material and started making out of blankets and it just caught on so that's a little nice little fact for you but <clears throat> this jacket is a little pricey it's gonna run you about three hundred fifty dollars on the Filson website but here's the thing think about let, let's let's go back four or five years right now and let's see, add up the coats that you've purchased, your winter coats for, for the last five years. And let's, let's total them up. And you're going to think about how much money you spent on winter coats for that time. 
This jacket is going to last the rest of my life. It's going to be passed down to my son, and he's going to be able to wear it. This thing is guaranteed for its life as well. So if you think about the price of a jacket that's going to last you the rest of your life as your winter coat, that's not very expensive at all. $350 is just a drop in the pond because you're, you're purchasing good American quality. You're purchasing something that's going to that's gonna last, that you're not going to have to replace, that's going to be there when you need it. And this is just super durable wool. Uh, I love the product wool. I, this, a lot of people, they think wool is, it can be a little itchy. And I'm not going to lie, at first these can be a little itchy, but after they get broke in, the, this is this is so soft to the touch. I, I can wear a, a short sleeve shirt under this, and it's it's very soft. So it doesn't it doesn't affect me. There's it's it's not very itchy. I would say after about a month of wearing it with a long sleeve shirt, I was able to wear it with a short sleeve, and it, I can't even tell it's there. It, it is so soft. So I highly recommend this coat to anyone who's looking to purchase one. Um, don't be scared of the price because you're you're getting what you pay for and then some. So. On my rating of this product, I'm going to give it a 5 out of 5 outstanding product by Filson. Uh, I can't wait to try to get some more gear from them. I'd love to get their, their tin pants and give those a whirl and give them a real thorough review as well because I have no doubt in my mind that their product is just going to just gonna blow me out of the water. I mean, it's outstanding. So uh, a Filson coat is a must. Well, thanks for stopping by today, guys. I appreciate you guys uh, watching the video. Uh, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, get your families outdoors, and I'll catch you next time.